Hello everyone, it's Kelly Jo. Welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be showing you guys five different hairstyles that you can do. And a couple of these are somewhat simple, but a few of them are a little bit more difficult. But this first one is going to be pretty easy. I'm just um, pulling half of my hair back into just a regular ponytail. And after I tighten it up a little bit and kind of mess it around with it to make it look more relaxed, I just take a small piece from the ponytail and I start braiding it all the way down. And it's kind of hard to braid because it's such a thin piece of hair, but um, after that, I wrap it around the hair tie. And after I do that, then I just pin it up with a bobby pin. And I didn't really do this that well. I should have redid it probably because it kind of fell apart. But um, basically, you just pin it into place and it covers up the hair tie and it looks really cool. It looks more elegant, I would say, because you can't see the hair tie. But yeah, that's the first one. I think it's cute and it's a nice way to kind of make just a regular half up more fancy. And then this second one is another fairly simple one. You just pull your hair back into a half up again. That's how all of these hairstyles are going to be. And you just flip the hair halfway through. And so instead of pulling the hair all the way through like a ponytail, you just stop halfway and it forms like a little floppy bun like that. And I just added a cute little hair clip to it and it looks super cute. So that's the second one. I really like this hairstyle. I think it's super easy and it's just pretty yeah easy to do <laughs> um this third one is going to be a half up braid but we're going to make it a little bit more interesting so i just braided the top half part like that basically <laughs> i'm kind of bad at explaining this but you just pull it apart like what i'm doing right there and you can just keep it like this like a half up braid but i took little sections from each side and made little mini braids just to add something extra to it so kind of like the first hairstyle you braid it all the way down and they're just these little mini braids but we're not going to wrap them around anything these are just kind of hanging there alongside the bigger braid and i think it looked pretty cool um i tried to pull the braids apart a little bit after i like tied them off but since they're so much smaller than the main braid it was kind of hard to do that but that's what it looks like i think it looks really cool it's like a bohemian type of look and i will definitely do this one again because i think it looks pretty neat so there is that one and then this fourth one this is a french twist kind of half up do type of look and um i pulled up half of my hair except i kind of left front sections hanging down and i french twisted those front sections like as you can see right there and i pulled it apart a little bit and just twisted it all the way down like that and i put it in my mouth so that it would get out of the way and then i just did the other um side the exact same way i french twisted it and just added hair each time i twisted it and after I did both sides, I um, pull them to the back and tie them together. And after you tie it together, you kind of pull it apart and flip it around like that. And you pull it through the main ponytail. I don't know if that makes any sense, but um, you can kind of see what I did there. And it just makes it look really fancy because it, again, covers up the hair tie so yeah this one turned out kind of messy but it's still super cute and this is actually the hairstyle that i did for aiden and i's wedding reception and um i didn't add a clip to this one but you can keep it like that or add a clip or something and it looks really pretty this last hairstyle the fifth one is going to be a half up dragon braid so i just once again tied up half of my hair like that and i clipped it to the front i like flipped it over and then did the exact same thing a second time underneath it like that and then i flipped it back down and i spread it in half and pulled up the second one through if that makes sense and then i tied it off and then let it go and then just do the exact same thing split it in half 
wrap it around the other ponytail and you'll tie it off and it's just a continuous pattern like that um it's kind of hard to explain and I was kind of having trouble with this one um I almost started over but I just kept on going and I eventually just kind of flipped it to the side so I could actually see what I was doing um so when you flip it over to the side like that you actually bring pieces from the back to the front and then tie it off and you'll want to pull this one apart quite a bit in order for it to really stand out and I honestly think the messier this one is the better it looks um, it just looks super cute and kind of natural looking <laughs> when it's all messy and pulled apart like that and I did add that cute little um, flower clip to it again and it looked so cute um, it definitely takes practice and it's the longest hairstyle to do but I think this one is my favorite and I hope you guys enjoyed these hairstyles bye